This all comes out of an investigation done by the Department of Health and Human Services and the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid. They sent a letter to Life Center Kirkland outlining their findings, essentially saying that the Life Care Center mishandled the coronavirus, saying the way they did it may have put some patients in danger telling them they have until September to make changes. This all comes out of a March 16th survey of the long-term care facility conducted by the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services and the state's Department of Social and Health Services. According to their findings, the facility failed to quickly identify and manage sick residents, adding they didn't properly report to the State Department of Health about a potential outbreak. Yeah, Russ Rapp's mother was in that facility, contracted the coronavirus and died. It's tough that she spent the last days in uh, isolation at Providence. Couldn't even see her or anything, so that was tough. The last thing I told her was, you know, chins up. I'll bring your laundry back as soon as possible, and that's the last I had to say to her. I didn't know, you know. What are you going to do? According to a CDC report, in early March, there were 129 confirmed cases of the coronavirus in connection to the Life Care Center. We did hear from the Life Centers of Kirkland this afternoon. They say that they're working closely with the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid and that they've even made some of the requested changes, but say they do plan to appeal other findings. They wouldn't go into specifics and say they won't be publicly. In Seattle, Sebastian Robertson, King 5 News.